Hey baby girls, ¿qué onda? ¿Cómo están? How is everybody doing? I know, I know. I've been gone a little bit, but I'm back, I'm back. <laughs> so we're gonna be working with this design today. So let's get started with the products we're gonna be using in today's design. So we're gonna be using Flamingo. We're also gonna be using Blossom Pink. This is Heartbreaker, and this was from my Valentine's Day collection from last year. Well, no. No, no, no. What am I talking about? This year, this year, this past uh, Valentine's Day, okay? We're also going to be using our number 14 Kalinsky brush. Also, I'm using my monomer, which is not on the website yet. I'm still working on that. But yeah, I'm using my monomer. I'm using my crystal clear acrylic. That one will be restocked soon. I'm also using these two dappen dishes that you guys see there are from my website as well. You guys are able to literally find everything on my website so yeah baby girls um actually not really because some things are sold out <laughs> for example blossom pink is sold out i think blossom pink will be back until valentine's day um that's gonna be restocking and then and not right now you guys because um it's not gonna get here on time it's not gonna get here on time for the christmas release So, yeah, um, I think it's just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and order it, restock it, but it's gonna be restocked until Valentine's. But, um, yes, baby girl, so for today's video, we have a long one, <laughs> but you guys know a beautiful design as, as, as always, you guys. I try to always bring you guys good designs, beautiful designs for you guys to try and recreate um beautiful 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 so yes baby girls um we're gonna go ahead and do a frenchie here on the index nail oh my god on the index nail we're gonna go ahead and do a frenchie this acrylic you guys is super 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 buttery um and this is currently out of stock it'll be back in stock till february for um or january when the valentine's day collection drops just because it's not gonna be here on time when i need it to be here on time you know what i mean so yeah baby girls it's gonna be restocking till next year don't worry about it it's it's a couple of freaking months away okay so don't worry about it <laughs> um it's a beautiful beautiful pinky nude you guys i love it it's one of my favorite nudes to be honest um or pinky nudes but yeah you guys um we're gonna go ahead and add it all throughout the nails the only different nail that we're gonna have is the index like i said because we went ahead and did a frenchie um but yeah you guys have asked me about the nudes okay you guys so um a lot of you have been asking me about bombshell and a lot of you have been asking me for sparkle pink so those notes you guys and i think it was bombshell sparkle pink and it was another one i'm not sure which one it was um let me see okay okay i got it <laughs> um i had to go check you guys but it's cover lush sparkle pink bombshell and a butter pecan and um birthday suit okay birthday suit and butter pecan is what everything you know they're like here to stay okay like those are like the main ones here on the website that i will be always restocking on okay butter pecan and a birthday suit those are the ones that will always be back in stock um Those will probably be back in stock when the Christmas collection drops and all that. So don't worry about that. Um, about the rest of them, which is Cover Lush, Bombshell, and um, Sparkle Pink. Those three colors, you guys. That's when I was still working with my old supplier. The one that was always messing up the colors. The one that was, was always, you know, either making them too too light or too dark they were never it was never a consistent color you know what i mean um gracias a dios i'm right now i'm currently working with a new supplier which their products are freaking bomb.com you guys have seen that um 
and their nudes are consistent like their nudes are just literally consistent if i order another batch of let's say um blossom pink it'll be the same color which is what i was looking for so unfortunately right now i'm working with them to see if they're able to kind of make um sparkle pink the same and um bombshell and cover lush i'm working with them to see if you know they have something similar to them um something that we can work with or you know just so that we can have something similar to that um they have one that kind of looks like um bombshell and another one that kind of looks like sparkle pink i might have to go with those two you guys but i don't think cover lush will ever come back in stock you guys because again that's for my old supplier but if sparkle pink and bombshell come back they're not gonna be exactly the same you guys that's why i really don't know if it's gonna be back um i'm currently waiting for some samples that they sent me to see if it kind of resembles what i'm looking for and of course i will keep you guys posted on that because i'm not too sure yet but um the rest are for example um the ones that we currently have which is butter pecan birthday suit blossom pink dolce vita biscotti bronze nude make me blush soft spot those will always be back in stock you guys because those are consistent colors now with my new supplier um so yeah i'll keep you guys posted on it i'm so sorry i know i'm trying my best i promise but from now on all of these new nudes that recently had dropped they will always be back in stock because we have a new supplier the consistency is the same and the quality the colors everything will be exactly the same so yeah baby girls um i'm so sorry again but yeah anyway moving along so we're gonna go ahead and just add our blossom pink all throughout the nails you guys the only different nail that we're gonna have here is the index nail which we made a frenchie as you guys saw here and we're gonna go ahead and add flamingo on the french area of that nail so i literally don't have any tea you guys i'm currently doing orders so just bear with me bear with me bear with me i have a couple of orders to take right now to do actually to package and to take over to the post office now like today i need them out today and um yeah i just wanted to get this video out because honestly i've been a little mia and i'm so sorry for that you guys honestly i'm gonna i'm gonna be honest you guys i feel like youtube sometimes is a little stressful you know what i mean um having just so many things going on in my life it's just a little stressful you guys i i always tell you guys this i know i probably sound like a broken record but i'm so sorry but i do have a life outside social media you guys and you know sometimes i just want to spend quality time with my family just watching a movie for once and not having to you know be running back and forth between my family the movie and recording or doing orders or you know what i mean and i know you guys i know this is something that i signed up for and i love it don't get me wrong i love what i do nails is my passion this is why i decided to you know come out with my own um acrylic brand or my own just nail brand or um website or whatever you want to call it but yeah you guys i know i i put myself in in you know into this you know i brought myself into this but i love it i do i love it i love it i love what i do i i love my store i love my brand i wouldn't trade it for nothing in the world you guys honestly but you know yeah sometimes i do need that quality time with my family just um having you know cafecito con pan with my husband and the kids and just joking or having a monopoly night or you know what i mean then i'll take it you know what i mean i'll do that and i'll put um, you know making content for later 
um or during the week or i'll, I'll be just, sometimes like um i have i record like during the weekend i record friday or saturday um or even sunday sometimes um but you know what sometimes even those days i'm like you know what no i'm not gonna record this weekend i'm gonna leave it to my to my family and so that's why sometimes you don't see me posting on monday or tuesday um or wednesday <laughs> you've probably seen me posting till thursday and friday but that's gonna change you guys because we're only gonna be having one video every week now because i really wanna you know take it down a notch a little bit i was doing too much you guys i think I'll, i'm burning myself out um it's just getting to the point where it's too much you guys it's too much i need to i need to have you know some time for myself some time for my kids some time for my husband and i don't have that you know what i mean so yeah there's only gonna be one week one week what one video um every week i'm still not sure if it's gonna be wednesday thursday or friday most likely either thursday or friday you guys um i'm posting today but probably starting next week we're gonna start posting um fridays so yeah baby girls um that's gonna be it only one video per week now <laughs> i know i know you guys i know i love making content i love what i do but yeah, that's really taking a toll on me and it's starting to become very stressful and I don't want it to become like that because I love what I do. And if it becomes stressful for me, I'm not going to love what I do anymore. You know what I mean? So I don't want it to go there. But yeah, that's that's pretty much what I wanted to tell you guys. Um, And yeah, so I need to do orders, you guys. I need to finish these orders that I'm currently working on. I need to get this video out today. So yeah, let me go ahead and do that. And you know, I'll be coming in and out of the video. Right now, I'm just gonna go ahead and finish doing the little Frenchie part. I'm gonna go ahead and cap. I'm gonna leave you guys watching that part. I'm gonna go ahead and file. Um, I'm gonna leave you guys watching that part as well. And then I'll come back for the nail art.
Okay, baby girls, moving on. We went ahead and finished filing. Well, we capped, we filed, we buffed, we cleansed, and we're ready for nail art. So for nail art, we're going to go ahead and use this liner gel that I got off of Amazon. It comes in, like, in a big pack of like so many different colors, you guys. Um, and I got it specifically for Halloween, which I think I only used the pink and the purple. <laughs> I don't know, you guys. Yeah, I'm crazy like that. But anyway, yeah, we're going to go ahead and um, do this little, we're going to do three little pumpkins, like stacked up little pumpkins. Oh my God. What am I saying? They're going to be three little pumpkins stacked up on top of each other. You guys have seen those designs, so I'm pretty sure you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do a hot pink one. We're going to go ahead and mix that same uh, pink that we used. We're going to go ahead and add a little bit of my white and my black. Those two are available on my website. Um, and now we're going to go ahead and lighten that pink up with the white. Um, we're going to be doing the exact same thing for that. I am using my liner brush in 15mm. I love the 15mm for this type of gel nail art, you guys. It's just amazing. I love it. If you guys haven't gotten your hands on it, what are you waiting for? You need the 15mm liner brush, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and do this, fill it in, and then after we've completed that, we're going to go ahead and do another color. But this time, we're going to go ahead and mix the white with the pink. You know what I mean? To make it much lighter than this one and then um we're gonna go ahead and do like the little outlines the little pumpkin crevices and little things like that um backwards you're gonna be seeing that in a minute So this is what I mean, you guys, the lighter pink tone, like we started with the hot pink and we ended up with the light pink. You know what I mean? Now for the little crevices or the little outlines of the pumpkin, we're going to go ahead and start with the light pink and we're going to finish up with the darker pink at the top. I hope I'm making sense, but you guys can see here exactly what I'm doing. I know I'm horrible. I'm terrible at explaining things, at explaining what I'm doing, but I'm pretty sure, you know, everything is here, okay? Don't worry. You guys are able to see everything perfectly here and see what I'm doing. So we're going to go ahead and finish that up. We're going to go ahead and cure under the lamp for about 30 seconds. And then once we completed that, we're going to go ahead and do the little, what's it called? Um, the little, it's not a, tr no, it's not a trunk. I don't know, you guys. That little thing on top of the pumpkin. I don't know what it's called. I'm sorry. 
<laughs> but yeah, I don't know what to call it. You guys can see here what I'm doing, okay? <laughs> Okay, so now for the index nail, we're gonna go ahead and do the little patches. We're gonna patch her up. So we're gonna start off with the pink, with that hot pink. And we're gonna go ahead and do this like little square design type of thing. We're gonna be doing two, okay? It's gonna be one like here where I'm placing it right now. And then it's gonna be, the other one's gonna be on the other side, a little, a little lower than this one. Um, we're going to go ahead and fill it out and then we're going to go ahead and cure under the lamp. So once we're through with that, we're going to go ahead and patch her up. I want to see. And then we're going to go ahead and just trace the little patches. And we're going to go ahead and do like the little, like the little stitching around, if that makes sense. It looks beautiful, you guys. I loved it. I really did. I love making this design. It was like so easy to do. So beautiful. So pink. Just, you know... It was so beautiful, you guys. So I really hope you guys enjoy it. I really hope you guys love it. But yeah, you guys, we're going to go ahead and do that. Um, I went ahead and cured this in the lamp for maybe 15 seconds. I'm just kind of like flash curing in and out. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and do the little stitches around. Okay, so for the thumb, I wasn't really sure what I was going to be doing here. So I'm like, you know what? Um, let's just do more patching here. So I went ahead and did the exact same thing we did on the index nail. I went ahead and did it here on the thumb. But, you know, it's just a little different, meaning the patches are placed a little different, if that makes sense. So we're going to go ahead and do the exact same thing here.
I had also bought this, um, what's it called? Um, spider gel, something like that on Amazon for Halloween. It comes with a whole bunch of different colors, you guys. But again, I didn't even use it. Um, but watch me freaking miss this. I made a mess, you guys. I freaking made a mess. And I left it so you guys can see what a huge mess I made. I grabbed a whole lot of it. And you're not supposed to do that, you guys. So here, I went ahead and cleansed it with alcohol so it's not sticky or anything like that. And I went ahead and grabbed a just like a thinner portion of it. You have to work with thin little portions, you guys. Because if you work with thicker portions, then it's not going to turn out good. Okay, so be aware of that <laughs> so after that i went ahead and top coated um the ring finger because what we're gonna go ahead and do a little bit of 3d so i went ahead and added my matte top coat here and again it's available on the website um so we're gonna go ahead and top coat it i went ahead and cured it for about 60 seconds came out of the lamp and i had already started with 3d you guys i actually had done a white flower but then i'm like girl there's nothing white here there's literally nothing for it to like stand out it wasn't really looking cute if that makes sense mm, so i just decided to go in with heartbreaker from my um valentine's collection as i had mentioned at the beginning of the video and we're gonna start to do our little 3d by the way i am using my 3d brush um these will be back in stock uh probably hopefully when the christmas collection releases we're gonna have a whole lot of new things available when the uh christmas collection releases you guys so i can't wait for that i am so excited for the christmas collection all the glitters are oh my god there's they're gorgeous you guys so yeah we're gonna go ahead and do our little 3d flowers here you guys can see how buttery and easy it is to work with these acrylics you guys you guys can see it here i freaking loved it you guys i loved it so i'm gonna go ahead and do three little flowers and i left them all for you guys to see and yeah i'll be back
And look at our brand new top coat, you guys. This is 18 ml. This is a huge freaking bottle. It's huge. Look, compare it to the old one that we had. It is huge, you guys. It's freaking huge. And I know how fast we go through top coats. So I'm like, you know what? We need a bigger top coat. The consistency, though, it is a little thicker. I'm not going to lie. It is a little thicker. It's not as thin as the old one. If you guys like the old one because it was a thin consistency. Um, I'm sorry, you guys. But, yeah, this one is thicker, which honestly, 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 I prefer this consistency. I freaking love this consistency. It's not too thick and it's not too runny. I feel like the old bottle, like the consistency was a little bit too runny. You know, it was like, a, it was a beautiful consistency. Don't get me wrong. And the shine, girl, the shine was beautiful and amazing. But I don't know, you guys, I fell in love with this top coat. I cannot rave about it. Like, oh my God, you guys, you need this top coat. The bottle though, girl, the bottle though. <laughs> and yeah, you guys, so I'm going to go ahead and top coat. Um, well, we made the pinky and the index nail shiny. And then um, the rest of the nails are going to be matte. Um, and that was pretty much it. So I went ahead and cured under, under the lamp for about 60 seconds. Once it came out of the lamp, I went ahead and added a little bit of cuticle oil. Um, this is available on my website as well. Um, and it is a rose scented cuticle oil. You don't want your cuticles looking all crusty dusty So please go ahead and add your cuticle oil So yeah, baby girls, this is the end result and look how freaking gorgeous I love this design you guys. I'm gonna be honest. I think this one is my favorite Halloween design that I made this year I love it you guys maybe because i'm a pink uh i'm a pink lover i'm a pink girly i freaking love anything pink but yeah you guys look how freaking gorgeous i love it i absolutely fell in love with it i was rocking them for a while 
<laughs> but I knew I had to remove them, you guys, because honestly, I cannot work with this length. It's way too long for me. So, yeah, girls, this is pretty much it. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I really hope you guys liked our very last Halloween nail design. And we'll be back here next Friday with another beautiful fall design. <laughs> We're not going to be doing no more Halloween. It's going to be a fall design, you guys. So, yeah, this is pretty much it, you girls. I will be seeing you here on the next one. Have a blessed and beautiful weekend. Also, be safe out there for Halloween if you're going to go out or take your, your kiddos for Halloween or trick-or-treating. And yeah, baby girls, God bless you. And bye-bye.